So many people in my life have actually asked me why I don't teach magic on YouTube and to them I say, well, it's kind of complicated, but I'll try to keep it as simple as possible. And it's also not for the reason you're probably thinking of. I don't mind magic tutorials on YouTube. I'm very grateful for them because without them, I wouldn't be a magician, honest truth. Number one, toxic people. Basically, over the last few years, or not even the last few years, over the last many years, there's been this sort of debate about whether magic should be taught on the internet. And like, there's also been like a debate with social media magic, but just like, because of this sort of big debate within the magic community, it's been spawning all of these very, very toxic people who are just like so toxic and just scream stuff like, um, you're ruining magic, why are you exposing our secrets? Screw you, F you, I wish you died in hell, go to hell. Uh, magic's being ruined because of you and I just like scream all of these stuff like like little children at least to me it shows what their intentions are like they don't actually care about magic they just want to start up drama and just like I just want to say to them like hey just drink a cup of water if you actually care about magic you will see that you know magic's not being ruined it's taking into a good direction because with all these sort of tutorials online that you know that people can access it's a lot harder for like people like me to sort of pursue the path of magic or like people who are wants to start out magic but don't have a lot of money and just like because of all this toxicity i just didn't really want to deal with it as of right now i'm just like it's like these people are being just like so toxic and i'm just like ugh and don't get me wrong i'm not against the idea of teaching magic on youtube and i know for a fact that you know I'm gonna have to deal with these sort of toxic people sooner or later like that's just sort of the volatility of YouTube and like not even just YouTube social media in general just like you know if I can save myself the headache then I'm all good number two competition basically um what I mean is that there's so many people who are just trying to teach magic on YouTube that it sort of became like an oversaturated niche. Like there's so much competition that it's hard for example any individual creator to stand out unless they have some sort of previous success. Like I guarantee you if you someone looked hard enough, I guarantee you you'll find the same magic trick being taught over a hundred times on YouTube. I guarantee you because everyone's just doing the same thing and because of this it just it makes it impossible for like for example someone like myself to sort of stand out do, doing that sort of the same thing and also like what would set me apart like even if i were to start teaching magic effects what would set me apart from the other probably thousands of creators out there like i have an iphone 6 i edit on my iphone i have a broken tripod like you know like it's hard for me to sort of if i were to start teaching magic like it would hard it would be hard for me to stand out from all, all the other small creators and not to mention all the other big creators out there like there's so many other bigger names out there like for example like chris ramsey daniel madison shit lim uh ekaterina spidey alex pandrea um rise magic you know um and a guzman like you know like there's so many other bigger names out there that it just it's would really really hard for me to stand out and not to mention all these bigger names have audiences which is better for the youtube algorithm because if you have an audience and people would like the video the algorithm would start sharing it with other people which which if they like the video like they sh then the algorithm would share it with more people like you know more and more and more it's just like ultimately even though i were to start filming magic effects and tutorials it's just not only not worth the time it's not worth the effort as of right now of audiences if you're not already subscribed to my channel already hit the subscribe button but that's reason number two let's go to reason number three and finally reason number three reason number three is well honestly it just it's not something i really want to be doing as of right now like when I make these videos, I always try to make sure I put passion behind them. I always enjoy them, you know, I always have fun with them, and to be honest, teaching magic tutorials on YouTube is just not something I feel passionate about, at least as of right now. Like, again, I'm not against the idea, you just, you know, for me, I always want to make sure I'm having fun with these videos, so, you know, then, that, you know, that you guys can enjoy the videos too, and just honestly, I don't feel passionate about teaching magic. 
not something I want to do right now. I honestly just want to experiment, to try out new things, try out different things, you know, and it's just to sort of experiment with my channel. And I hope you guys will come along with the ride too. Just honestly, like for me, just like, I want to put passion to what I'm doing, the videos I make. I want to experiment, try out new things. And that kind of what comes where, like, where my sort of um, catchphrase come from. Just like, you know, like if I'm not doing something I enjoy, then why don't I just go do something else and find something that I'm passionate about. And yet if I'm not, if I can't put passion into what I'm doing, then why am I doing it in the first place? Like, you know, like for me, just like, it's so important that, you know, that when I make these videos, I'm having fun with the videos. Because that if I'm having fun with the videos, then I know you guys will enjoy the videos too. But anyway, so yeah. This is honestly why I don't plan on teaching magic any anytime soon. And yeah, if you guys like this video, leave a like down below. Um, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And most recent videos are popping out on my screen. And remember guys, do what you love, love what you do. Peace.